That's right. We're talking about another beautiful day for us here in Central Texas. Lots of sunshine, mostly sunny skies, a few clouds out there this morning. It is on the cool side, and I do want to point out that it's still kind of breezy for some. Here's a look at the temperatures we're waking up to this morning. Lano 45 in the upper 40s for Giddings. Notice everyone has a north wind right now. That's going to keep us on the dry side and allow us to have the mostly sunny skies. 50 degrees right now for LaGrange as we head to Lago Vista. You're also in the mid 40s. So still breezy out there. Winds are going to be sustained all day long, anywhere from 5 to 15 miles an hour. Right now, the strongest of those winds are with our central counties from Georgetown down to San Marcos. San Marcos sustained at almost 20 miles an hour. That means gusts exceeding 20 miles an hour for the start of Monday. Here's how the next 12 hours are going to play out. It is a little cool out there this morning. We're going to quickly warm up into the 50s by lunchtime near 60 degrees and then calling your forecast high this afternoon of 65. So if you're in town for South by Southwest, your official forecast is spectacular today. Mostly sunny skies, mid 60s again on the breezy side. Don't forget to let us know how you're enjoying our beautiful weather. You can tweet us at KVU or also we're on Facebook, Instagram, even Snapchat find us and follow us. So here's what's going to go on the next 48 hours in Central Texas. If you're a fan of the weather today, good news. It's going to continue tomorrow. Lots of sunshine out there. Forecast highs for Monday afternoon in the 60s for pretty much everyone. Then we're cooling down tonight with a few clouds, partly cloudy skies in the 40s. Cool, comfortable, a light sweater, maybe a long sleeve shirt if you're enjoying any late night activities and then including more sunshine tomorrow. Just a couple degrees warmer tomorrow and not as breezy. That's going to be the main change in your forecast. So I would say even improving conditions for tomorrow. Allergy forecast grass is going to be on the high side. Unfortunately, we're expecting elm and oak to be low though. So good news for all of you that suffer from those two allergens. We'll keep you up to date every single day in the statesman. The next seven days includes increasing cloud coverage and increasing temperatures by this weekend. A spotty shower chance with temperatures back in the 80s for this weekend. Ladies.